So you want to book a shoot and you have no idea what comes next? Here's three key phases of production that you should know. Phase one, pre-production. This is planning the overall video shoot. I feel like pre-production is a vital part of the video production process. They say if the pre-production is good, the video is shot before you even hit record. Here are a few elements that you should think about in the pre-production stage. Storyboarding. Storyboarding is a visual representation of what's going to be shot. This can be sketched out, put into a PowerPoint, but this should reflect shot by shot what is going to be filmed. This can also include, but not limit, camera movements, lighting, etc. The script. You need to decide if the video is going to require a script. Videos can just be b-roll shots, but you need to decide that beforehand. If you introduce a script after the video is shot, it will be a hard time in post-production to correlate each individual shot. Talent in voiceover. Whether you are casting for models or just using friends, you need to deliver the information about call times, wardrobes, parking, and so much more. This is an aspect that you should not be doing day of production. Assets. Assets include, but not limited, to graphics, lower thirds, and music. If you need any graphics, title, or lower thirds in the video, you should figure that out beforehand. And if there's any specific song you want to have, you'll want to make sure you have the rights to use it on whichever platform. This will save a lot of time in post-production. Shooting location and space. If you know the location you're going to film in, make sure that everything is clean and ready to be shot in. Make sure that anyone in the space is aware that you're filming. Pro tip, if you're filming in a public location, have signs that say filming in progress. This can be especially helpful if you're filming in a place and you need clean audio. Timeline, if you're filming outside, you need to take into consideration on where the sun is going to be and when it's going to be there. <laughs> and lastly, deliverables. Understand what you want out of that video shoot. Whether it be a 15 second Instagram story, a 30 second web video, in order to know what we need to film, we need to know what is gonna be expected at the end of the shoot. The second phase, production. Production is the actual filming of the project. If your pre-production is good, this should be a breeze. Let the professionals take care of the job. For us, typically it takes 30 to 45 minutes to set up the first shot. This can vary between shoots. Take this time into consideration when you set your call time. A call time is when everyone needs to be on set. And lastly, post-production. Post-production is the creation of everything we did in pre-production and post-production. This is the actual editing of the video. Like I said, if the pre-production is good, you'll know exactly what you'll be getting. For us, it typically takes five to 10 business days for delivery depending on the specific deliverable. Once you get that video, you'll have the opportunity to re-edit or revise that video as you see fit. This can be different for each video production company, but for us, we do a two revision policy free of charge. So say you want to change a shot or add a graphic, you'll be able to do that two times free of charge. Depending on the budget of the project, people often neglect certain phases in video production. People will fill themselves or skip out and handle the pre-production for themselves. But it's important to understand these key phases in order to have a successful video shoot. If you want to win a Rode Wireless Go 2s, all you have to do is follow Joby X Ray Mundo on Instagram and subscribe and comment down below. And until the next one, we're out. Peace.